going everyone so in this video i've got one of the new exotic armor pieces to show you this is for the hunter and it's called the gemini jester it's an exotic piece that allows you to blind enemies whether it be in pve or pvp so it can be very useful i've had a lot of fun trying these out in both the crucible and wandering around the planet so let's take a look over the actual perks and what these things are all about. So let's look at the little flavour text here. I love making people laugh, and by people I mean me. Ha 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 me. That just sounds like Cade, it really does. So let's look at the exotic intrinsic perk here. So we've got misdirection. Dodging disorientates nearby enemies and temporarily removes their radars. It basically makes them run around like a headless chicken because they have no idea what just happened because obviously this is a very new exotic piece and I'm sure people have been baffled when I've confused them in the crucible. Moving on, we have increased mobility and increased resilience. Obviously I go for resilience on my hunter and I've also added a health health mod at the bottom there so there you go that is it pretty much they look they look cool we can't change the color unfortunately so I will show you what happens when you add a shader it literally doesn't really do much to be honest like the purple doesn't go away and you can just change the the little shorts bits I, I suppose they kind of look like chaps I don't know but yeah it just changes the shorts at the top there unfortunately so my hunter does look a bit silly at the moment as you can see purple pants and green camo for the rest of her ah, what a fashion statement so I was using these exotic pants in PvE I have found them pretty useful if you're surrounded by a large group of enemies you can just dodge out the way and you'll be able to take them out a lot quicker because they won't be shooting at you and also couple this with the Night Stalker subclass where you can change your dodge ability instead of reloading you'll actually go invisible so that is very useful as well so for example in the crucible if you see your radar is full of red you can dodge so you'll disorientate the enemies and you'll turn invisible so you can either run away and get a different angle or just run in there guns blazing and hopefully take out a few people I'm not entirely sure how long the effect lasts because I have disorientated people and they pretty much shot me straight away I believe it's literally just a few seconds unfortunately I've got no clips of myself getting disorientated by anyone in the crucible so I can't really show you any of that side of it but I've got quite a few clips throughout this video of me using it mainly in the crucible because that's where I found I wanted to use it the most just to see how effective it was and if it was a viable crucible exotic so there have been a couple of times where I've sat around a corner or I've seen that there's someone near me or around the corner I do the little dodge and you'll get an audio cue if you disorientate someone and also down the bottom left it will say misdirected enemy so obviously you've actually blinded someone nearby and you can go out and shoot them also another thing to bear in mind if you disorientate an enemy in the crucible and one of your fire team members kills them you do get awarded the assist so overall i would say this is a very good exotic i mean it's not going to take me away from using my radar helmet for my hunter but it is still quite fun to use and it may be really useful in trials where it's a bit more competitive and you want to be using as many different things as possible and hopefully disorientating enemies will help your fire team to get that win this exotic just basically gives you the upper hand especially when it takes away their radar and it blinds them for a few seconds so they really don't know where you are so this exotic gets a thumbs up from me it's definitely one i'm going to be hanging on to and i will probably be using it more often in the crucible just to change things up a little bit Anyway, I hope this video has been helpful. Let me know in the comments below if you'd like to see any other reviews and I'll gladly get them out to you. Anyway, have an awesome day and I will see you in the next one.